Well, for your Thursday, we are still tracking out the effects of Tropical Depression Francine. It's moving at about 12 miles per hour right now with sustained winds at about 35 miles an hour. And again, it's moving through Mississippi and continuing to push northward towards Arkansas and Tennessee, bringing a lot of heavy rainfall and fast moving winds throughout the area. So right now for today, we are on a flash flood watch until 1 p.m. And that is because we've got such an extensive amount of rainfall within these past 24 hours. So if you are having to get out on the roads this morning, remember that if you see any water flooding up on the roads to turn around, do not try and drive through it. And with that being said, we also have a wind advisory in effect today until 7 p.m. And that's because sustained winds for this morning, heading into this afternoon and evening are going to be around 40 miles per hour to start out your day. However, that's going to continue throughout the afternoon with those wind gusts being about 20 to 25 miles per hour heading into the evening. So rather windy day in store and with a lot of heavy rainfall, it makes for a muggy Thursday. So timing of the showers out once again, Thursday by 8 a.m. A lot of heavy rainfall over our area, but Francine is going to continue to push northward throughout our Thursday, leaving a lot of cloud coverage behind and leaving those fast wind gusts behind as well. And even though Francine will be moved out of our area, it's not going to be moved out of Mississippi until late Thursday night. So again, leaving those clouds hanging behind for your Thursday evening, leaving those fast moving winds as well. So like I mentioned earlier, a lot of heavy rainfall in such a short amount of time. Central Mississippi is expecting anywhere between three to seven inches, which is again why we have that flash flood watch in effect for today. And West Alabama is expecting between two to four inches of rain from Francine, but that rain is much needed. Taking a look at that drought monitor that was released last Thursday, this rain will definitely be beneficial to help relieve some of that drought that we have been experiencing. And we are tracking out other areas of interest in the tropics as well. This is tropical depression seven, but it's in the central Atlantic, not gonna impact us anytime soon. So taking a look at those next seven days, we have that weather alert issued for today. However, the rain clears out for this weekend. Showers don't move into the picture next week and temperatures by Wednesday reaching in the 90s.